see anything, crew? Nope, not yet. It is pretty dark out there. You know you're right, Captain. Why don't we just head back to the octopod and then... Whoa! Something's upset them. <gasps> what was that? That's it. That's the thunk I thunk I heard when I saw the spider run. I think. Activate microphone, Peso. Let's listen and see if we can figure out where that sound is coming from. Captain, it's coming from over there. We're getting closer. Closer. Whatever it is, Captain, it should be right here. It's the spider! Hello out there. We mean you no harm. We are the Octonauts. And one of us doesn't like spiders. Who are you? And why are you grabbing our guff? Oh, I'm sorry. I wanted to say hello. I am a spider. I knew it. I knew it was a spider. Amanda Kim and Twimpy alive. Crab. Huh? Excuse me. You're a what? A spider crab. A giant spider crab, to be exact. Of course. A giant spider crab. I should have known. So you're not a scary spider? Eh? Oh, no. I just look like one. I'm really a crab. <sighs> the largest crab in the entire ocean with many, many legs. Fascinating. Yes, I have eight legs and two pincer arms. Pincer arms? They help me to move around and grab things to eat. Ouch! What's wrong, Mr. Giant Spider Crab? Oh, there's something stuck to one of my legs. Oh, Ouch. no! It's a giant clam. Oh, it's very heavy. And noisy. So that's what that scary thunk, thunk, thunk noise was. It looks painful. We're coming out right now to help you. Right, Quasi? Right, Captain. Oh. <laughs> this clam is shut tight. I've seen this before. When clams get stepped on, they close up to protect themselves. It's nearly impossible to pry them open. Huh. This could take a while. Um, why do these things always happen when I'm in a hurry? What's the rush? I'm trying to get to a birthday party. Whose birthday is it? Mine! My children and grandchildren are having a great big party for me. I'm a hundred years old today. A hundred years old? Shiver me whiskers. Oh, yes. We spider crabs can live for years and years, long enough to meet many of our grandchildren. I just hope I get to see mine today. Don't worry. We'll have this louse out of you in no time, just as soon as we find him a sperm whale. There's something big coming up. A vast. It's a whale. Oh, but it's a blue whale, not a sperm whale. Hmm. Keep looking, everyone. There. Nope, that's a humpback whale. I knew that. Oh, I'm starting to feel a little faint. Oh, you're feeling faint. How do you think I feel? <laughs> Hurry, Captain. They're getting worse. We're coming up on another well now. Uh, I can't tell what kind it is, Captain. It's a... Uh, it's a... Uh, a sperm whale! Excellent. Peso, you'd better suit up and... Oh, whoa, whoa. Hey, you stay away from my baby. Oh, the whale's mother. Sperm whales will do anything to protect their young. Hang on, everyone! Whoa, whoa, whoa. The mother whale's not giving up! Peso, Quasi, I'll keep her distracted. You get the louse on her. But how are we going to do that? Yeah. 
Okay, Mr. Louse, this is it. Oh, oh, I don't know if I can make it. Oh, for goodness sake. But this is where you belong, on a sperm whale. I'm just too weak. Hurry, Peso. I don't know how long I can keep her distracted. I've run into some complications, Captain. I'm going to have to perform an emergency lousectomy. Lousectomy? Lousectomy? But I'll need my medical bag. Ah! Just tell me what you need, matey. Tweezers, Quasi. I need tweezers. <laughs> ah. Now I can't see inside you, so let me know when I'm getting close. A little, a little to the left. Steady. Oh, too far left. Now to the right. Steady. You've almost got him. Steady. And... Gotcha! Oh! Oh! <laughs> hey, hey, I'm home! How do you feel? Oh, now that I'm back on a whale, I feel great! Thanks, Doc! And what about you? I feel great! Captain, the louse is on the whale. I repeat, the louse is on the whale. Both he and Sponge are doing fine. Great work, Peso. This is fascinating. Another example of commensalism. The louse gets a home and the whale doesn't mind at all. Octonauts, to the launch bay! <laughs> Wellington, what's going on? Captain, this is so exciting. You found an immortal jellyfish. I, you, you still have him, don't you? <laughs> right here, safe and sound. What's so exciting about it, matey? An immortal jellyfish can do something no other creature can do. Turn back into a baby and start its life all over again. So that means an immortal jelly can live forever? Yes, unless something eats it. Don't worry, I've got it. Captain, the immortal jelly is the only creature in the world who makes this amazing change. I've never had the chance to see one for myself. Until now, we'll keep this baby immortal jelly safe until you can get here. Thank you, Captain. Octonauts, let's do this. Oh. 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 Ah. Wait, uh, where's my notebook? Uh, and my magnifying glass. Oh, oh, thanks, Tunit. No, no, I'll drive. Tweak, open the octo hatch. Be careful, Shellington. Oh, don't worry. Right. Uh, oh, 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 that's better. Captain, I'm on my way. I'll be there as fast as I can. All right, Shellington, but don't worry. We'll take good care of this baby jelly. Now all we have to do is to wait for Shellington. Do, 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 do. Shellington, Shellington. Oh, where are all those bubbles coming from? <gasps> whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, no! Where's Dorian? There, mateys! We've got to catch that jelly before the whale swallows it. No, it's heading for the whale's mouth. <laughs> Time for some tickling. Tickling? We'll tickle the whale to keep his mouth open long enough to grab the baby jelly. Quasi, you take the tail, I'll take the belly, and Peso... I'll take the jelly. Let's go. Activate Tickle! <laughs> yeah, got you! <laughs> 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 hey, hey! Whoa, you guys! <laughs> now that was a good laugh! Phew! He's right over here. I wrapped him up in kelp so he wouldn't drift away. Everybody, this is Periwinkle. <laughs> this is who I wanted you all to meet. My new nephew. 
Oh, look at look him. how fuzzy he is. But he's still just a baby, so I spend most of my time feeding him, cleaning him, and teaching him how to find food. Once Pet is a little older, he'll be able to dive down to eat red urchins too. As a matter of fact, it's just about time for Perry's first diving lesson. Oh, but I still have to catch up on my urchin duties. Pearl, why don't you and Shellington give Perry his diving lesson and let us clear the urchins out of the kelp forest? Oh, that would be wonderful. Octonauts, let's do this. We eat red urchins like this. Now you try. Oh, no, sweetie, that's a rock. Barnacles to Shellington. How's the diving lesson going? Well, Perry's found three red rocks, two red shells, one grumpy red crab, <coughs> but no red urchins. How about you? It took a while, but we managed to clear the red urchins out of the kelp forest. Oh, well, that should keep them under control, at least until it gets dark. Captain, red urchins are most active at night. They might try to come back when the sun goes down. In that case, we'd better stay the night. We'll take turns looking out for urchins. Now, you're sure you'll be okay up there, Shellington? Of course, Captain. Nothing like sleeping out under the stars, sea otter style. Ah, we're holding hands and holding on to kelp so we don't uh, float away. Uh. Uh. Yeah, sharky, sharky, sharky. Aha! Looks like she's after an octopus. Got you right where I want you. Oh. Actually, it looks like I've got you. Let go of me, octopus! I won't be able to follow that pup anywhere if that octopus gets her first. Uh, I know. Ah, take a shark! <laughs> Tweak's new camouflage worked like a charm. That old octopus thought I was a... <gasps> take a shark! Wait! I'm not really a tiger shark, I... Ugh. These little pups really do get confused by the cups. Quasi to Shellington. I'm following one of the hammerhead pups, and she's a wily one. Good work, Quasi. Don't lose her now. Well, that's two of the hammerhead pups. Just one more to find. I can smell food. I just can't see it. <coughs> you can't get away from me. Hey, where'd you go? Oh, my head is stuck. <laughs> hey, somebody, help! Look, down there. The third hammerhead. And he's stuck. <laughs> We're the Octonauts. We're here to help. <laughs> he's really stuck. We'd better call for backup. There, the last one. Peso, Quasi, come in. We found the third pup, but his head is stuck. We need your help. Stuck? We've got to help me, brother! Captain, we're on our way! <laughs> come on, our brother's in trouble! Oh, no! Ahoy, Peso! These little pups could have a good chase, don't they? You're telling me? Uh, Peso, Quasi, over here. Oh, oh, ouch. This does me feel too good. Some slippery ointment should help slide his hammerhead out. Good idea. Everyone else, grab a fin. There. Don't worry. We'll have you out and swimming in no time. On my count, everyone pull. Ready? Three, two, one. Uh, guys, look behind me. 
Oh, fascinating. Hammerhead's eyes allow them to see what's behind them, like that... Shark! <gasps> this should give him something to chew on. Oof, oof, oof. Hey, those things don't taste too good, do they? I'm sure you'd taste a lot better. <laughs> uh -oh. Hey, bet you can't catch me. Hey, so follow me and bring your friend. Quasi, keep that shark busy. Over here, you scurvy shark! Hey! Oh, oh where'd they go? Here! We've got something tasty for ya! <laughs> ah. Now! <laughs> Everyone, get back! <laughs> What's the big idea? Leave us alone! Why? What's happening? Uh-oh! Hey! <laughs> Well, I think he got the point. That was so cool. Well done, everyone. He is. Don't forget about me. Whoops. Sorry about that. Ready? Pull! <laughs> Pull! <laughs> we did it. Oh, thank you. Yeah, thanks for all your help. Not like we needed it or nothing. Hey, we've got to get going. See you around. Come back here, you! Ah, that should do it. The gub connector is working, Peso. I'll have the gub eggs back together in no time. Huh? Peso? Yeah, got you! Uh oh. Tweak, come in, Tweak. Can you hear me? One more time, Quasi. One, two, three. Oh, dear. It's hopeless. This ship isn't going anywhere. And neither am I. We're not giving up, Lenny. Yow! The gub's moving all by itself. Tweak must have repaired the gub connector. If we follow the glider, we'll find our way back. Lenny, are you all right? I suppose so, thanks to my extra hard shell. <laughs> Ow! Oh, my flipper! It hurts from being wedged in those rocks. I can't swim in this condition. You'll just have to leave me here, I suppose. Oh, dear, dear, dear. You need to see our medic. Peso, come on, we'll carry you. Hello, Tweak! Hello! Where are you? Whoa! Flappity flippers, the octo ski. Tweak fixed the gub connector. Wait for us. <laughs> Whoa! 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 Hey, so you found my rover cam. Thanks. You're welcome. And there's the rest of the gub eggs, right on schedule. Look, it's Captain Barnacles and Quasi. And the Loggerhead Sea Turtle is with them. Oh, no. He's hurt. This flipper splint should do the trick. Oh, it feels much better. Thanks. I guess things are looking up after all. Lenny's on the mend, the rover cam is back, and the Gup X is all in one piece. Now, we just have to find our way back to the Octopod. Um, Cap, I fixed up the gub connector, but I'm afraid the mapping system still doesn't work. How will we find our way out of here? Maybe we won't. Maybe we'll spend the rest of our days lost in the sea of vanishing ships. Lost? Oh, I never get lost. We loggerheads have a great sense of direction. I travel in and out of here all the time. You don't get confused in all this murky seaweed? Not a bit. <laughs> and now that you've fixed my flipper, I'm ready to swim. Then lead the way, Lenny. Don't mind if I do. Incredible! You've led us straight back to the octopod. Thanks, Lenny. Aye, Lenny. You're a... He vanished. Boo! Ah! ah. 